so many important events to celebrate, and only one company is big enough to deliver them all. Here comes your DJ has only just begun. Me never call it crime panacea. Me never say he locked up. No. Me never take a dollar for a drink. Politics and them love act up. I the youths, them I feel it, that's why me reveal it. So we live it day to day to day. This are no category, this are the real story. So for and stay. Long time away from my family, my family. Living day to day. Gotta make ends meet. Give thanks to life, loot and fair represent. Mindset every Wednesday, 7.30 p.m. UK time. I just star. Tell it to them. Free mind, free souls, free spirit. That's it. I mean, be a positive people part. Mm-hmm. Drive out the car. Who am I rule? No, I just star. Yo, you don't know so the mindset each and every Wednesday. I just star. Lay the people in the right way. And so we stay. And Zabri. Bam, bam, bam. X. 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 Tread. Tread. I ain't a treat if you're not listen, I just start. But mindset. Rock them and crack them. You're in tune to the mindset. Let the action speak. Do something that's timeless. Rock them and crack them. Jabari I represent it. I just start. You can fuck. Well, my name is Richie Stevens, and right now, I want to hear them know. See, a vertical machine I'm saying. So, lock into mindset every Wednesday, 7 p.m. to 10 p.m. UK time. That's saying. So, yeah, you know. Let's drink. To the hard-working people Let's drink To the lowly of birth Raise your glass To mindset the greatest And let's drink To the championess Stay on E It's the mindset, free your mind, free your mind, mindset, free your mind, free your mind, hey, not everything that glitter is gold, everything that's gold. me I tell you, mindset. Mindset. Mm-hmm. Yeah, man, some said the rod of the wicked shall never prosper against the righteous unless the righteous place his or her hands unto iniquity, then they too shall go down into a pit. And then I say, boast not thyself of tomorrow, for thou knowest not what tomorrow may bring. Let the people praise thee, and not thy own mouth, as stranger, and not thy own lips. A stone is heavy, but the sand is weighty, but a fool's rock is heavier than them both. And then I say, rock is cruel. But anger is outrageous, who is able to stand before envy. Open rebuke is better than secret love. Faithful are the wounds of a friend, but the kisses of an enemy are decidedful. Cut and clear! Cut and clear! Cut and clear! Blessed love, manners and respect, do give thanks and praise for life. This is the Mindset Program, I just saw my host, and I'm here with a great honor to be here with the Honorable Muta Baruka. Yeah Come man, give thanks Muta. man, Rastafari. Yes sir, I give thanks. First and foremost, I want to congratulate you on your lifetime oh, achievement. Oh, yeah, I repent. Yes. But we don't get it yet. We don't get it yet. No, the 24th. The mindset, thought provoking, you know. I'm your host, and I'm a I just start, and we're there with our brand new mindset series live on the YouTube. Subscribe, I just start mindset channel, YouTube. Blessed love.
Blessed love, blessed love, blessed love, pleasant good evening, good afternoon, warm welcome, holy man well I, King Selassie I, Ja, Rastafari, glory be to the Father, to the Son, to the whole one of creation as Ja, was in the beginning, is now, never shall be, Ja, world without end, so heal our God, Selassie I, Jehovah God, Ja, Rastafari, the Almighty God, Ja, who seated it in Zion and reign it in the heart of all flesh. O thou most eternal Father Jehovah God, Jerastafari, right, hear us and bless us, O Lord. Cast thine holy face to shine upon thy, thy children, so and I shall be saved and redeemed. Holy Manuel I, King Selassie I, Ja, Rastafari. Bless and sanctify, sanctify and bless. Warm welcome again, honorable family. Do give thanks and praise. For life, I and I am um, greatest position right about now. Anywhere we stand up, you see me, I say, yes, I. Um, if it's the first time they had them tuning into the platform, the channel, um, they had them could hit that subscription button or bell, you see me, I say, so whenever time we're here again, um, they had them can be notified, all right? Yes, yeah, so, um, what we are looking upon, we are looking upon, um, sacramental ganja zine and really and truly we we're going to read an article from um the gleaner all right and um basically this article is about the ethiopia africa black international congress um ganja farm zine yes um I know probably not for the item is first time the item probably gonna hear about this or you know become aware of this zin um I come across the article so I'm just gonna share the the article with the item we're gonna drop the link also in um the description so the item can um you know get the full entirety of um the article it's coming from the Jamaica Gleaner Zin and um, it is titled. Let me just show the item exactly what we're talking about. Uh, this thing and now show me where it's supposed to show me. Zin now show me where it's supposed to show me. So uh, let's leave it. Let's leave it at that. It now show me. What me did one? Can I make it sure we still you know? You see me? Can I make it sure we? Okay. All right, my people, make we get get this thing here. Get this thing here the way we want it. You see me? So the item can see it. All right. Yeah. So the item can um see what go on here monitor all right for some reason it not really assure us uh, more more obviously so yeah all right so basically um is a ganja farm that is run by or owned by the ethiopia africa black international congress and um it's been read recently zine and that's that's um we want to read the title the title is rastafarian priest stand by jail centamas ganja farmer zine yeah so and this is this article is from the the 13th yeah the 13th of um march and i think the incident is from the the 18th of february so let's um let's go at night let me go at night i'm not gonna waste no time i'm not gonna waste the item time zin so um member of the ethiopia member of the rastafarian faith group Ethiopian Africa Black International Congress 
zine, which is Ethiopia Africa Black International Congress, have come up in a strong support of Ryan Harris, the St. Thomas man who has accused the police of wrongfully invading his property and destroying his ganja farm in Dumfries in the parish. That is the parish of um, St. Saint Thomas. Continue reading. The half acre plantation of ganja which was raided by the police on the 18th of February was allegedly being used for sacrament, sacramental purposes by the church. Now, the church is the Ethiopia Africa Black International Congress. Zin, Harry Stott Ballad said that he... He has the right to grow ganja on behalf of the organization based on the amendment to the Dangerous Drug Act in 2015 which allows members of the Rastafarian faith to cultivate ganja on designated lands. Despite the claim the 44 year old man was charged by the police with position of dealing in and cultivating ganja. He was offered station bail at 200,000, which was revoked when he appeared before the St. Thomas Parish Court in Yalas yesterday. The circumstances surrounding the revocation of his bill were not clear at, at press time as journalists was not allowed inside the courtroom. Harris is set to return to court next Thursday. Three men, which is three men, who identify themselves as priests within the EABIC were present at the courthouse where the case involving their colleague was to be mentioned. Speaking with the Gleaner, Priest Norman Laman said, I don't know why they would do this because we have been exercising the sacramental right since it has been instituted and it is surprising that at this time there is an attack on our farm. Laman said that the Dumfries plot that was destroyed is one of the location at which ganja is grown for religious purposes. We have a few other farms that we use for sacramental cannabis cultivation none of our farms have had any problems before so this is the first time a farm that is directly advised and supervised by the church has been affected nevertheless i cannot say i cannot say the police I cannot say the police have repeating. Nevertheless, I cannot say the police don't, don't have a reason. I don't know if there are imposters out there using signs that have caused them to be uncertain. So I don't know if there are duplicate signs authorized by us but i am yet to find out why they have destroyed the farm that have that they were told is under direct permission of the church when the police went to the farm they were told that it's under the church supervision but they still took one of the attendants 
the attendance that was there and that's why we are here Laman said the Rastafarian priests were were unequivocally were unequivocally were unequivocally in their support for Harris according to Lamont we are standing in solidarity because this is not a fake site this is one of our recognized sites that was being operated under the knowledge of the church so we want to make that pronounced and establish it's not any kind of fraud farm or imposter it's one of the legitimate permitted farm that the church knows about rastafari and that article is taken from um the gleaner zin the gleaner yes i that article is taken from the gleaner zin so the item as i said i'm gonna drop the link i'm gonna drop the link in the in the description so the item can um check it out as we just read from um from that article zin so um that is a designated farm that um the honorable priest is saying that is um of the ethiopia black international congress and as the item can see up there that is also a picture that is taken from um the uh jamaica gleaner with the honorable priest zin yes um the honorable priest them that is there zin is um is priest norman lamont zin delroy williams and also richard fisher Zin, those are all honorable priests of the Ethiopia Black International Congress. Zin, now, um, if if we have legal rights to all these farms, as um, the honorable priest mentioned, that you know, since um, 2015, from um, certain laws was passed zine the dangerous drug act in 2015 they have been um uh, running their sacramental um ganja farm zine and that is for the church and we hear the jamaican government um say a lot of things you understand but what i can't see from 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 even this because one's most understanding you know, that the ethiopia africa black international congress is not just any place zine it's not just any place and it's not just any congress you understand this is a world renowned congress that the jamaican government are aware of zine because some some um year ago are you know past the 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 head, head of state of england which is um queen elizabeth the second said that there is a certain man in jamaica that um no one should put their on and these honorable priests and myself here that is talking we are all members of the ethiopia africa black international congress zin so no one should really um be interfering with what the congress is doing because it's an international congress and it's no congress is there's no other congress of 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 its art you know what i mean there's no other congress there's no organization like it anywhere and jamaica should be proud of you know such institution that has bring you know even tourism you know even bring um money towards the tourism sector 
in 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 Jamaica by you know people coming to the Congress every year, year in year out. You know what I mean? So the Congress is a big contribution financially, seen by people coming in every year in Jamaica, seen, and we must we must overstand that, seen. So, I want to just share some little clips with the item, Zin, and I feel like these um, clips are imperative and important. Um, I hear the Prime Minister of Jamaica, the Honorable Andrew Olness, um, said some things a few years ago. You understand? Said some things a, a, a few years ago, and... Um, we want to we want to remind the item what the honourable um, prime minister um, said at the time. So here goes. We have one of the best music in the world. We have a industry. We have a record. And why we have an industry? Because we talk about creativity, but we have never sat down to think about the legal side of it, the money side of it, and the things that make it work. And I am fearful that we're going to have the same sort of fanciful talk about what wrong, who getting that benefit, and so on. You hear him clearly, I said, why? You know the ones them who have 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 done all the work over the years. They are the ones that will be um, squeezed out. And I know the Congress is not um, farming herb to sell. It is you know for sacramental purposes, as they say, it's for religious purposes. So it's 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 not even um, where they call it um recreational you understand not even recreational so make we um make we make we make we play another um um mp what this mp was saying regarding um jamaican ganja and where we stand um as a people with jamaican ganja zin everything all interlink my people so just listen this how to grow it. But in less than five years, there'll be very little value in growing weed in Jamaica. It will be like any other commodity. The true value in the future of ganja, cannabis, and I call it ganja because I don't want the world to take away our brand, will be in pharmaceuticals and branding. But today, no small farmer with historical know-how will ever meet the standards now required for production. The licensing authority is approaching it as if every applicant wants to become an exporter. This established bureaucracy is locking out our small farmers, Mr. Speaker. The same one who created the product so many years ago and suffered at the hands of the police for something which is now a global sensation and is legal in several countries have no way of getting a slice of that taste. Is them do it, is them build it. If those small farmers never go up in the hills for three, four months and sit down and hide, yes. you wouldn't know about Jamaica and Good Ganja. Straight. The government must establish and fund a facility in partnership with one of our universities to allow small farmers to manufacture and process their raw weed for a fee. Yes. Into products that the market demands. This must be a national lab. It must be a national Jamaican lab. So when the Israelis or the Coloradians or anybody else hear about it, they must know that they can come to the Jamaican National Ganja Lab. And Mr. Speaker, this lab must have the added responsibility of promoting Jamaican Ganja, the best in the world. Mr. Speaker, we need to stand up for our ganja brand, right? We need to stand up for it. We have the competitive advantage of branding of this product in the world, but this is disappearing fast, and I don't want to see it disappear. All of us have an obligation to make sure that we don't see it disappear. Mr. Speaker, I had hoped to end my presentation on this high, but there's something else that I'm extremely passionate about. 
We have one of the best in the game world of the world. We have a record of the world of the world. Because the car is not free of the leader. But we have never sat down to think about the leader side of it, the money side of it, and the business that is worth. And I am fearful that we can have the same sort of fanciful talk about what we're doing. We can have the benefit and so on. We don't understand that unless and until we sit down and start on the money side, start on the leader side. Side and the side. We can wake up tomorrow, you and today, to start the world man and take it away. Because there's not enough to make it work. And that is what I am fearful of. I said, look, it is all my well good to be jumping high and joy out it. But at the end of the day, our question must be, do we want the industry or not? And if we want it, how do we make it work? The legal side, the regulatory side, and the banking side is what we need to focus our attention. And everything else by granted, it's so by a by a by integrated farming when was a sustainable because check it the earth is a nitrate fixing plant peas are also nitrate fixing plants you know we have a non-nitrate fixing plant you have to plant the herb when they do the crop rotation for fuck for you understand what i say are you still a plant herb in between some banana tree or a plant peas at the root of the herb plant so yeah diversify the income stream yeah reduce the level of importation push a one billion dollar of food jamaica import you know we take less than three months to grow you know here me I show the eye. And the ganja farmer is the most serious farmer. Why? My plant to meet them, I can leave the farm. But my plant the herb I reach her in time never living in the morning. So the commitment we make to the plant is greater as a ganja farmer than any other farmer. Yes, so the same thing they are dealing with herb, you could have deal with the cabbage and the tomato and the pop chai and all them things the same way. Same time. You see what I say? So oh, one plant now, if you see it for what it is and see the people for who they are and do create a problem when a problem do exist and use that natural is there. Rastafari, yes I, yeah man, honorable um, Dr. Knife, Zin, a reason for um, marijuana, Zin, yeah, and you know the differences and 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 you know how it how it transform, you know the 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 mind and the thinking of people, you know, cause you know it, it mentioned even from within um certain time within the music you know what i mean the type of um ganja in a jamaica that um did that influence the music you know what i mean the ganja that artists were smoking you understand and not just artists still but because him did a talk about the music but apart from that zin apart from that um you know we 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 have to we have to we have to um respect also the law of the land and i'm not just talking um us as a people i'm talking also the people um, who set these rules and these laws they need to respect it as well and when they see people um abiding by those um rules and regulations then they shouldn't um they shouldn't invade zine and try to uh, destroy because that is what happened in in this um this incident you understand with uh the the the, the bridging them uh the ethiopia africa black international congress um uh ganja farm zine is not i i make up anything you know come you know you have some critics out there go say boy uh, the boy i just time uh, him, him come and him and put out all these things pan um the 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 the, the social this and the social that and it, it, it's it's not i <laughs> you know what i mean it's in the green of the item can check the description we're going to put um the description of of um of this thing in in the gleaner so um before we go we're gonna drop on um, one more little clip Zine, as I said, all these clips are 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 important and they are them need for for hear these things. So um let me run this one before we go. The, the rats over there. We have one of the best music in the world, but we do have an industry. We have a regular and why do we have an industry? Because we talk about creativity, but we have never sat down to think about the legal side of it, the money side of it, and the things that make it work. And I am fearful that we can have the same sort of 
fans if we'll talk about what wrong, who getting that benefit and so on, without understanding that unless and until we sit down and sort out the money side, sort out the legal side and the business side, we can wake up tomorrow, you included, to start the world man and take it away from it, because we have not enough to make it work. And that is what I have feared for us and said, look, it is all well good to be jumping high and joy about it. But at the end of the day, our question must be, do we want an industrial law? And if we want it, how you make it work? The legal side, the regulatory side, and the banking side is for me to focus our attention. And everything else, quite frankly, the so Rastafari, you see it? So, you know, what me I wonder if, you know, we should be um, um, cultivating herb to 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 export because you know it's a business worldwide you know people are selling herb and we know that um jamaica have have um so to speak the best the best marijuana cannabis in 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 the whole world i know some people might say boy and i know, so it go which part of them they have better herb or you know what i mean so you know we should be looking at um you know having a business you know having um a dispenser as they as they would call it you know what i mean and as we say um it's not for recreation because them say um what them call it them call it um medical cannabis medical marijuana zin and we would have um sacramental marijuana you see me i say grown by the Ethiopia Africa Black International Congress and I don't see why um we shouldn't have a dispenser somewhere um in the island or on the island zine um distributing and you know making sure that people can get good herbs because there's a lot of herbs out there now a whole pa ganja out there now where um those ganja is not grown the, the 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 right and proper way some of them is grown in greenhouse and they're not getting um natural sunlight and all of these things and you know so for the church to have farms we should be looking into having dispensers also so you know we can give people our best product also you see me i say Broom and mat, we sell that. Those are just one thing. You see me, I say? No, we have to start think, zin, elevate the thinking. You understand? And don't stagnate the thinking because no one has said why um, King Emmanuel never in a buying and selling herb and, and, and these things. But um, time evolve and uh, 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 probably why that i did i say certain things at at that time is because of um the circumstances and some of those circumstances has changed you understand so i don't say why um we couldn't um you know uplift ourselves by you know having these dispensers that people can get proper um medical sacramental marijuana from the ethiopia africa black international congress my lord and empress these are my few words i want to thank the item for taking the time out for tuning in as i said earlier if it's the first time the item is tuning into this platform which is i just started a mindset please hit that subscription button so whenever time we're here the item can um, be notified Zin, this program was powered by black star international media over there in Houston, Texas, large up the item self. Also, yard slang closing. Zim one for large up the item. Manners and respect. Give thanks. Zim. So hit that subscription button. Zim. So whenever time we die again, the item get that notification. So more love, more strength, manners and respect. Holy Manuel I, King Celestia, Ja. Rastafari, cut and clear, jeans and snare, pollution of the atmosphere. Ja, Rastafari.